The Crude Life with host Jason Spies. My name is Jason Spies, and this is the Crude Life Daily Update. On today's episode, we talk with Wesley Kate from Eco Energy about pipelines as critical infrastructure. Kate talks about how pipelines are aging and natural gas has become a very important part in powering our lives. In just a moment, part of our exclusive interview with Wesley Kate with Eco Energy right here on the Crude Life Daily Update. My name is Jason Spies and this is Wesley Kate with Eco Energy. You know, when when we look at uh, at infrastructure, I think there's three components to that discussion. You ha- you actually have su- supply, which is really historically where we've always been focused from a conversational standpoint. It's always well natural gas supply. You know, everyone wants to talk about the growth and, and that is exciting and I don't want to take away from that. But I, I think it's important that we sh- start to shift that narrative over to the demand side, because that's really where we can start to label this as, as a critical infrastructure component. Um, you know, when, when we look at where pipelines are going and what they're providing for us as a society, um, that's really where I, I believe, Jason, we can, can shift this into that critical infrastructure category because natural gas in 2018, we were 35 percent of your overall power demand. Um, that That's massive. Coal, coal was at 27% and nuclear was at 19. So I, I think that, you know, when we look at critical infrastructure and, and power, electricity, that all falls under critical infrastructure. So if our pipelines are providing 35% of our overall power portfolio, I think that's critical. And then when we look at the 2018 industrial uh, natural gas consumption or industrial consumption, 28% of that was natural gas. So when you look at your, your GMs, your Toyotas, your Pfizer's, your AK Steel's, your new cores, um, on your industrial complex, 28% is natural gas. And that was Wesley Kate with Eco Energy. To listen to the full length interview or to check out other exclusive interviews, visit thecrudelife.com. That's thecrudelife.com. Join us on social media, follow, like, subscribe, be one of our 350,000 social media subscribers through the Facebooks, YouTubes, and even the Twitters. Go to thecrudelife.com, click on the social media tab. From the staff at the Crude Life Daily Update, my name is Jason Spies, asking you to always remember, energy is more than an industry, it's a way of life. Historic, the first full conversion refinery to be built in the U.S. in over 40 years. Innovative, the cleanest, most technologically advanced downstream project ever. The model for future shale basin projects, groundbreaking, with construction resuming in early 2019. The Davis Refinery. Make energy great again. Yes, that is the hat for the energy industry, folks. Wear it proudly. Show your support for the nation's energy industry with this attention-grabbing fashion declaration. Make energy great again. Pick up the only hat for the energy industry. Make energy great again. Visit keepenergygreat.com. That's keepenergygreat.com. 